Welcome to mini tutorials in spectroscopy. Let's talk about vibrational transitions. As the name suggests, a vibrational transition occurs when a molecule changes from one vibrational state to another. A simple harmonic oscillator model shows that we can view molecular vibrational motion to a first approximation as being described in terms of a spring force constant and the vibrational displacement coordinate. A more accurate treatment, however, also accounts for the fact that chemical bonds can break through inclusion of an anharmonicity correction. Let's use the vibrational parameters of hydrogen bromide to predict the transition wave numbers of the fundamental and first overtone transitions. If we employ the Morse oscillator energy level expression, we can describe vibrational level energies in terms of a harmonic vibrational constant, omega e, and the anharmonicity constant, omega e x e. To calculate the wave number of the fundamental band, we simply subtract the v equals zero level energy from that of the v equals one level. The first overtone is the energy difference between the v equals zero and the v equals two levels. Thus we find that the fundamental band has a wave number of omega e minus two omega e x e, and the first overtone band a wave number of two omega e minus six omega e x e. We can then substitute our numerical values into the transition expressions to calculate wave numbers of 2,558.540 reciprocal centimeters and 5,026.645 reciprocal centimeters for the fundamental and first overtone bands respectively. I hope that you found this short tutorial on vibrational transitions useful. See you next time.